Welcome to 393 Pinecone Strand in the village of Nigog Woods in Acton. This is a three bedroom, two and a half bath, Majorca two model with a single car garage and exclusive use driveway. As we come up the front deck, we enter into the foyer. She has a nice ceramic tile flooring. Before we head up into the main living area, it's worth pointing out that there is a nice size coat closet in the foyer area. This is where you'll find your electric panel. On the way up the staircase, you'll notice we have some nice oak treads. And the hardwood floors were recently refinished. They look very nice. We are in the kitchen dining area, and the dining room does overlook the parking area and the wooded area. We have granite countertops and really nicely well-maintained mahogany cabinets. These are the original cabinets, which appear to be refinished over the years. The dining area actually can fit even a rectangular table that might seat six to eight people. So we're back into the cooking area of the kitchen electric stove. There's a hood over the stove. You've got a nice stainless steel deep barrel sink with an updated faucet. We have under cabinet lighting. The poles on these cabinets have been updated. A nice tall pantry cabinet. The living room itself is a long rectangular room that has the opportunity for a couple of different seating areas, one by the wood-burning fireplace. So let me take the opportunity to kind of give us a look up what I call the treehouse of the Majorca. It's a wide open staircase. This is the other area for a nice little seating area. There is a wood deck. The structure of the deck is the responsibility of the association. We're in the midst of a deck project where new spindles will be placed on each of the back decks. You can see that on some of the units really a nice quiet view out the back. Again a wood-burning fireplace with a tile hearth. When we come back down the corridor we'll check out the half bath here in a nice granite countertop, new faucets, ceramic tile flooring, Head up the oak tread staircase. Take a view of the level below. We'll come up. This is the second floor full bath. It has dual sinks. There's a new whirlpool tub. I'll come in from the other side and we'll take a better look at that nice whirlpool tub. Before we go to the master bedroom, I thought we'd take a look at the loft bedroom, which does overlook the living room. And that open staircase. There's a light and airy feel of this unit. 
This is one of two large skylights in the unit. This loft bedroom has a good size closet with mirrored doors. This is the master bedroom. You can fit a king size bed in this room. It actually, this particular one has two sets of closets. You can see the cathedral ceilings. This is the other closet, which feels a bit like a walk in. And you can enter the full bath from the master bedroom. Just take a look at the newer Whirlpool tub. with a tile surround, and updated controls. And we'll head up onto the third floor of the unit. It's actually the fourth floor if you do count the lower level as your first floor. As we come up to the top of the stairs, we see the three-quarter bath. Again, updated with a granite countertop, refinished original mahogany cabinets with new poles, new faucets. We'll just take a quick look at the stall shower. It's a fiberglass shower. It's a newer shower. Now this floor is linoleum, whereas the other two are tile. And this is the third bedroom. It has a dual closet as well. And this is that second large skylight. Cathedral ceilings, fan, in the second closet, there's actually a storage area in the back. You'll see that on the floor plan. It's a nice size. And we'll come back down the corridor, back down the stairs. With the view all the way down to the main living area. You can see the loft there. As we come down the stairs, we'll see the master bath. Just take another look up. So again, you've got a bedroom and a three-quarter bath. Next, we'll head all the way down the stairs. To the lower level. At the base of the stairs, you'll see that there is a laundry and utility room. This unit does come with a washer and dryer. So you see the venting system, it is forced hot air, a gas furnace. The furnace the, and the air handler are here below in the crawl space. Around the corner is the hot water tank. And beneath the stairs, there is more storage. So as we walk into the back of the lower level, we see that there is a paneled family room. Again, a good size. This is right below the living room upstairs. We have a slider to a uh, crushed stone patio. Again, a good size. People have used that room for a number of things. And on our way out, we'll just check out the one car garage. There is an automatic garage door opener. And here we are, back outside. This has been the Sutherland Realty Group with Keller Williams Realty, Boston Northwest. If you have any questions about 393, please do give us a call.